she gets uncomfortable and she actually lays down the truth. Take a look at this. We have a very special guest on the line, a Democrat, my mom. Mom, hello how there, have you, Jesse. hello there, mom. <laughs> how have you um, enjoyed the show so far? I have enjoyed the show. I want to say congratulations, Honey Bun. We are so proud of you and your accomplishments, <laughs> you. and you've worked so hard. Now let's aim to have you keep your job. And <laughs> to that end, I do have some suggestions. Okay. Do not tumble into any conspiracy rabbit holes. We <laughs> do not want to lose you, and we want <laughs> oh, gosh. no lawsuits. Okay. In, okay. In yeah. keeping, I, I have a list here. In keeping okay. with the Hippocratic Oath, do no harm. We need you to become... Then how will he do a show on Fox News? I'm confused. Fine. And respectful. Okay. You yourself mentioned that humble is a stretch, so I, I get that. <laughs> Use your voice responsibly to promote conversation that maintains a narrative thread. There, there really has been enough Biden bashing, and the laptop is <laughs> old. Perhaps you could... The laptop is old. Listen to what she said. Just go Jesse Waters' mom. Perhaps you could suggest that your people take less interest, for example, in other people's bodies, and talk about that. Wow. Yikes. Oof. So, she's exactly right. And you could tell that wasn't fun and games anymore. She's saying, don't be conspiratorial. Stop talking so much or fear-mongering so much about Biden and stop talking so much about Hunter Biden's laptop. That's old news. And maybe actually try to have some significant, meaningful conversations and do no harm. And he's seen that.